Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit, quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we going to do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're going to stay here, and you are going to get yourself warm. Now, I sent 
John and Mike are scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out. See if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davey, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. Okay. All right. Let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. Get up. Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Davey, too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got fire and shelter. That's a start. Tell me you at least got the money before it all went to hell on that boat. We did. It's stashed with the rest of the money in town. It'll be safe for now. Wait, is that someone coming towards us? You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Uh, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. 
Both of them calendar boys is, or <laughs> was, yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. It ain't much, but shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. Just following orders, you know me. Right. Keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Okay. Let's head down there. Let's hitch up here. Yeah. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of them. Arthur, get in position. Come on! Hello? Shut up, Billy! Shh. Excuse me! Hello? Oh, well... Hello, friend! What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way. Lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. <laughs> we can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Folks. Oh. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur, need some. There's a body food in the wagon. I hear you. Just. Gentlemen. Ah, some Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please, I am.
doing too well. Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Ugh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. Get your strength up for the ride back. Huh. Looks like the poor bastard was married, too. At some point. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw it. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Micah found a dead body in the wagon outside. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. Southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. 
But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. Get the hell out of here. Go. Okay. Yes, yeah, boy. You let him go, huh? Saw so the little bastard scurrying off. Yeah. Figured he won't get far in this anyway. That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. Get that horse hitch. Don't want him bolting. Get away from me! Micah, what the hell do you think you're doing? Ah! Ah! Oh, I'm a knife out in the cellar. Why up there, ain't you? <laughs> Leave her alone. I wasn't doing yeah. nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Yeah. Are you... Oh, you fool! Michael! Miss. Now, it is gonna be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss! Miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. You okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they... Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Arthur. Miss, it's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. Homestead, but we weren't the first. Comb O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. And that's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler. Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? How come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed.
He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed, and he looked for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well... Seems somebody left. Recently. And... That way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Lead this way, Arthur. Not that way. Okay, boy. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. <laughs> Watch out for this crevice. killed a girl in a bad way, but it was a bad situation. That well, ain't like him, though. Tracks go left, down here. Davy got shot, Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we're only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Whoa! Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. It's not very wide here. Come on, boy. Horses are struggling. Yeah, a lot 
lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. If he can hear us. Come on. Up there. Yeah. Watch out here. From this way. Okay. And yet that we're high up here. You're telling me. Careful. There's a drop here. It's slippery. Be careful. Stay low under here. Okay, from here. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up here. Come on. Come on. Sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Damn, it's cold. How you doing? I'm miserable. Been a tough few days. I know. Here, take a drink of that. Thanks. I'm not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, where are you? John! You there? Come here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! Down here! He's down here! Hey! All right! Hot down, Marston! That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. 
Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Oh. You all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Look up there. Distract him while you get to the horses. Go! Draw them off. Okay. Here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Hey! Oh. Hey! <laughs> we'll get you out of here. Hey, we'll back out. Get them away from us. <laughs> right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Nah, you can do better than that. One thing you ain't short on is fantasy. Here. Let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? We get some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Right, here we go. There we go. <gasps> Ay, <gasps> careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. 
This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We've been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? We get strong, we get warm, and we wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough. I guess. You sound doubtful. Not doubtful, just worried. What do you think, Arthur? Well, I wasn't on that boat, so hard to say. But I trust your judgment, Dutch. Always have. Thank you, son. We have been shot at before, Jose. I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit, and we go back to Blackwater, and we get our money, or we get some more money, and we keep heading west. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. Oh, sorry. And the money's well hidden in Blackwater? I believe so. And they don't even know we dumped it. Oh, uh, well, you can wait then. Anyway, try not to worry. All right, then. We weren't there, Jose. I'm aware of that. And they shouldn't have been either. Oh, we can't change nothing now. Well, just hang in there. All right, Arthur. You okay in here, Molly? It might be warmer by the fire. I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Okay, well, try to stay warm. Okay, Arthur. Okay there, Dutch. Thank you. Thank you for bringing John back. Finally, some relief. He's beat up, but he'll be all right, I hope. Well, try to stay strong. Thank you, Arthur. Too bad, considering. It's okay. It's okay. You're safe now. She'll be okay, Arthur. I'm sure she will, Mary Beth. <sighs> you doing okay now? Ah, I think so. Thank you. Of course. Just a few more days. Anyway, try not to work. So. All right. Stay strong. It's been a nasty few days. I know. And we've had tough times before. 
We keep moving, and we keep together. Same as always. All of you. Ain't that so, Mr. Morgan? Of course. Hey, how's he doing? He's okay. He just needs some rest. Thank you again, Arthur. That's all right. Keep him warm. Well, just hang in there. Just he get us off this polished, damn mountain. That he hath no oblation. Chooseth the tree that will not rot. He seeketh unto him a cunning workman to prepare a graven image that shall not How be How are you moved. doing, Uncle? I'm okay. I've been, been through worse. Well, I did one time in... Uh... Sorry, I, I can't he right now. Not understood from the foundations of You've been the earth. happier now, Jack? Will he be okay? Yeah, I think so. The earth Just and the inhabitants rest. thereof are as grasshoppers. Well, try to stay strong. That okay. Out the heavens as a curtain Just need some thaw so we can get those wagons out. To dwell I know. We'll be okay. That bringeth the princes to nothing. Okay, well, the judges try to stay warm. Take care, then. Yeah. Okay, Mr. Strauss. I think so. Well done planted. for finding Mr. Yea, Marston. They shall not Some be good sown. news at least. Yea, their yep. stock shall not take root in the earth. Anyway, and he shall try not to work. Yes, I suppose. And they shall wither, and the whirlwind shall take them away as stubble. You know how these things go. We've been through bad times before. Like me, yep. Or shall I be equal, saying the Holy Well, Lord. just hang in there. Lift up your uh -huh, eyes Arthur. on high, and behold, who Ma has created I'm these real things. sorry about all of this. Hosts by number and My husband? All by My house? By the greatness yeah. of his might, don't know for that what he is say. strong in power, sorry. not one faileth. Why sayest thou, O Jacob, and speaketh, O Israel? My way okay, is hid Mary from the Lord, and my judgment is passed Jenny, over from Mac, God. Davy, Sean, and Hast thou who's not next? known? Yeah, Hast thou not through. heard that the everlasting God, God the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, fainteth not, neither is weary? Okay, well, there is no stay warm. searching sure. of his understanding. He giveth power to the faint, and to them that hath no might, he increaseth their strength. Is this? You're the one with the death wish. I am doing everything I can to keep these people alive. Pinkertons. Lots of them, and bounty hunters too, more than ever before. And all after us, we were set up in Blackwater, and none of them dumb enough to take that pass in winter or think us fool enough to do it neither. We got a few weeks. By the time they find out where we are, we'll be gone. Where to? I ain't got that yet. <laughs> but this ain't done. <laughs> Not no way. <laughs> Ain't sure how long we can realistically stay up here, Dutch. You warned them about that Blackwater job. Yes, but who listens to me anymore? Oh, well, we'll work this out. Okay. 